Damn. Let's go Premier League game first. A game of colossal importance and a stadium packed to the rafters. We can't ask for any more. How could it be otherwise when two high-level sides go toe-to-toe -to -toe and head to and welcome to a game that really should have pulses racing. Every reason to believe okay. this will be enthralling. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone, and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It's the absolute mad lads <laughs> up against West Ham United. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles cool, will win the game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The line-up for this game is Bruno Fernandes, Kevin De Bruyne. Well, they're playing with a 5-2-3, as we can see it here. But somebody has to step in to join those two midfield players. It could be one of the fullbacks, or it could be one of the centre-halves. So keep an eye out for that. Teammates and support. Oh, hey. is loose. Lund. Stopped a surefire goal. And a look at the West oh, come on, Lund. Well, they've got a good front three and a solid back five. But with only two in midfield, they could get overrun. It'll be interesting to see who comes in to support them, if anybody. I'm looking at the table. I think it's fair to say Leicester City have surprised more than a few of us playing a very attractive brand of football, playing to the full potential mm. and then some. Well, Derek, I didn't expect them to be in a Champions League spot at this point of the season, but they deserve it at the moment. Their early season form has been really good. The coach is certainly getting the best out of the players. Well, conceding the throw in. Good challenge. Reeve makes his way in field. Needs an accurate cross. That's come off the keeper. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. Well, they're almost extending an invitation to have them come at them. Well, that effort was always going wide. He's not fair going to be shot, I mean. Best pleased with himself. <laughs> oh. They've regained possession. Likes to run with the ball at his feet. Well, the cross didn't get past the first defender. Race. That's a good-looking ball. Can he put them in front? Come on. Yes is the emphatic answer. And you have to say it was on the cards. Well, let's look at this again. He's done superbly well to pick out a teammate here, while the movement in the box is equal to it. It's such good timing. What a goal. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Morten Hulman. Abel Rui. Well, very effective play in possession. Oh, tremendous reflex action there from the keeper. Well, he didn't have long to react, did he? But that's a top class save, I have to say. Box. Morten Hulman. Well, a stylish moment. Oy. And strong play here. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. <laughs> 
Silva. Oh, that's a fine pass. How about the cross? Oh, hey. Real chance. Well, the yeah. keeper really reacted brilliantly. Well, from that sort of range, it's a great save, I have to say. Cleared away. Okay, just hearing the situation has changed in the Brentford game. To what extent, Alex Scott? It's a goal for Brentford. It's now 1-0 with 37 minutes played. Thanks for the update, Alex. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Well, half-time coming up shortly and the home side on top. Stuart, interested to get your critique. Well, they've worked hard and played well to be in front here, but they now... And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. And there's the delivery. Come oh, on, man. What a goal. Here's another look at it. Certainly, delivery into the box couldn't have been any better, and the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. Back underway with the lead standing at 2 0. Box. Morten Hulman. And if you're wondering about out of time, two minutes it'll be. Potts and unable to keep possession. A chance then for the respective man. Hello, few changes. and running once more and in that first 45 sublime football from the lads will we see more of the same in the second half making a bit of headway plenty of players waiting in the middle the fans are shouting shoot ah. oh did so well to deny him and he's fired over the corner not all that convincing defensively. But it looks so threatening, but the danger averted. Well, as those stats tell us, their attacking play today has been exceptional. Defenders have come out at the right time. Uh. The midfielder completely dominated the game. And the front player's movement has been excellent. Well, not quite the come on, man. And they will make the change now. So the corner played into the box. Well, it's off target. They were Whoa. watching him like a hawk. Now well, something has changed in the Brentford match, I'm just hearing. Alex Scott can fill us in. It's another for Brentford. They've pulled one back with 54 minutes played. Many thanks as ever, Alex. Went in strongly, decisively. Well, it's just about a case of wall-to-wall -wall football live with us here on EA TV. And Stuart and I will be with you for this game coming up. I'm really looking forward to that. Two entertaining teams in what should be a really feisty affair. And West Ham in a position of menace. Oh, it's not a penalty. Fuck. Fuck, yeah. Fuck, yeah.
Yeah, man, absolutely. Um, absolutely, bro. Uh, I'll I'll add you on Discord. Let me put in the Discord name after the after the game. Valeri. The referee's letting match, it go yeah. as they keep the ball. Nicely timed tackle. Well, we always enjoy bringing you live action on EA TV and oh, come Premier on. League action coming up. It's West Ham United facing Manchester United. Encouraging move from West Ham. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. And back with Ledesma. <laughs> well, the Mad Lads have a corner and maybe a chance for them to make it look even better. And time for the change now. Well, he failed to get it away properly. Elected to shoot. Come on. And it goes. That will greatly help the cause. Now they only need to keep concentration levels high. Well, here we can see it again. It's all about the pace of the passing. One touch, slick movement, and then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. So they get the ball moving mm -hmm. again. 3-1 the scoreline here. What's going to happen next? Well, we're inside the final 15 minutes. Potts. Okay, Alex Scott can tell us all about a goal that's been scored at the King Power Stadium. It's a goal for Chelsea. Could the goalkeeper have done better? Yes, but let's not take nothing away from that finish. They're ahead by two now. And it's in! Oh. This game very much back on as a contest! The referee correctly decided to play advantage. Well, the fact of the matter is sometimes there is no advantage, and that was the view of the referee. They will now make use of their substitutes bench. Oh, nice ball. Not messing around with that clearance. Well, good run and good ball control. And in a perfect position to cut it out. There might very well be late excitement. Five minutes left, and the margin just one. Ooh. Oh, my goodness, what a strike from so far out. Absolutely <laughs> sensational. Unstoppable. Well, let's take another look, because this is a special goal. He's so far out when he strikes it. He couldn't have hit that any better. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Abel Rui. Morten Hulman. Well, he could really get at the opposition, but the danger averted for now. And so much space for Mad Lads out wide. Great opportunity! Thank <laughs> you. 
Could cross it in here. Well, that one has promise. Chance to finish. Able to get his body in the way. The referee blows for full time. It ends at a victory for the home team. No complaints from the fans here. Well, Derek, they were dominant in most aspects of the game, particularly in that midfield area, and they also look threatening in the top third of the pitch. It's a really good result for them. And in the final analysis, a really positive performance from this man, Stuart. Well, he looked a top-class player today. Every time he touched the ball, he was a threat, and he worked so hard for the team as well. What a good display that was. Time for just a few questions.
Okay, thanks guys. We're going to start with the questions now. A glittering and meaningful occasion. And all well, nights like these are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And we've got Champions League group stage fair on the menu. It's Wolfsburg versus the absolute mad lads. Well, thanks, Derek. This is such an important game. Both sides did okay in their opening matches, but lose today and they will be in trouble. This will be an interesting game, I think. And a look at the starting 11 for Wolfsburg. Well, it's great to see a team playing with wingers in a 4-3-3, but they've got to be effective, both with their dribbling and their crosses. Otherwise, they'll become bit part players. That's a good ball and unable to hit the target goal kick here yeah but it's good defending he knew he was going to be beaten in the air but he did enough to stop him scoring this is how the visitors will set up today well plenty of attacking width in this 4-3-3 but they'll need to get their midfield players to join the center forward as much as possible if not he'll become isolated and a fine stop to turn the ball away Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Busio. 
Bisuma. Perfectly positioned to take it away. And a throw coming up after that authoritative challenge. Bradley. Bisuma. Wasn't superb distribution by the keeper, that we can say. And the keeper more than equal to the task. And played short. Crossing into the middle. And a bit short with the clearance. Can they get in behind them? Chance to put them in front. And there it is. 1-0. The efforts have been rewarded. And look at the celebrations. Well, here's the replay. He does well to find that bit of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure to finish it off. That's a good goal. And back underway. 1-0 it is. Under pressure. Doesn't seem to be bothering him. Knezhevich. Tessiger. That's what you call defending from the front. Possibilities here. With the owner of the blue card part and side reception, please move it immediately. Thank you. Cedric Tessiger. Eve Bisuma has it. Now the absolute mad lads regaining possession. Foul play, says the referee. <laughs> Determined defending. They're really pressing their opponents. Can he finish this? And still a chance. Well, no damage done. And the ball back with Mad Lads now. Well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. Can't really allow runs like that. And the referee allowing advantage to accrue to them. Ibanez. Eve Bisuma has it. Good vision there. No nonsense clearance. Mate Jurasek. He's going forward well here. And the referee blows the whistle. It is a free kick. Played in there. Trying to find the right angle of attack. And what a magical save it was! And the short option preferred. Angles it back. Well, how about that for a piece of tackling to break things up? So, the whistle...
Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. Bissouma. Keeping possession of the ball with authority. Kevin Paredes. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. But they dealt with the threat posed. Paredes. Can they produce something? And drawing it back. Able to close down the shot. A lot to look forward to on the Champions League group stage front here on EA TV. Live, it's Wolfsburg against Atletico. That Will he find the net? Well, fantastic reflex action. Bradley. Ibanez. Eve Bisuma has it. Busio. Bisuma. Gianluca Busio. Perfect challenge. Good use of advantage. And they're eyeing that final pass, you just feel. Crossing opportunity. Looking for a teammate. Keeper getting the touch. It was an attack of promise, but they couldn't take advantage of the situation. Well, no shortage of live action coming your way right here on EA TV. And Stuart and I looking forward to being with you for this match. Well, the fixtures are coming thick and fast. It should be a good game, that. Hopefully, I've not just given it the commentator's curse. Oh, sloppy by the absolute mad lads. Well, it was a foul, but good use of advantage by the referee. Bisuma. Jurasek. And a very good challenge. Ramirez with it. Good looking sequence. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Not showing good vision. Good tackle. It'll be a throw. Something you don't see every day of the week. A triple substitution here. Bradley. That'll be a Wolfsburg ball. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Now we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. Options in the centre. Is this the moment? Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just look how well balanced he is. He knows he's going to be under pressure, but he shows great composure to hit the target. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Ten minutes to go. Lewis, real determination in the challenge, a throw in here, 
And they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. And Borges with it. An encouraging move from Mad Lads. Good through ball. And the referee says corner kick. take it short and whipped into the box well not away properly just the challenge that was required well the fans are certainly playing their part here just listen to this noise Where they go chasing the game. Brace. Well, good run and good ball control. Able to deal with the threat. And that is that. The referee blows his whistle for full time, and it's a victory for the visitors. Yeah, good result today, and with four points... for a few quick questions. Thanks, that's all the... 